Stakeholders have advised the federal government to put in place infrastructural and financial strategies to make Nigerian communities livable and sustainable. Plus TV's correspondent Habibat Hajai examines the theme for this year's World Habitat Day celebration. It's planning, sound planning, livability and sustainability rest on the principles of planning. The physical planning of our human settlements will make solving problems in the built environment easier. I am therefore compelled again to call on governments throughout Nigeria to become alive to their responsibility for planning while making use of the knowledge, wisdom and skills of town planners to help them in transforming their visions, policies and plans into blueprints as master plans, sector plans, district plans and others that will deliver us all settlements that are conducive for living. The relevance of this particular celebration for this year is that 90% of the huge number of the deaths that are taking place through weather-related disasters have occurred in developing countries, including Nigeria. We must create a culture that it is right by ensuring that we plan our environment. Plans must be developed, not to satisfy today, but to make nobody is left behind by assimilating good evidences, by ensuring that we develop inclusive cities, not only in within the large metropolitan areas, but across the state and the federation. According to data released by the United Nations, cities are said to account for more than 70% of emissions produced globally through activities of transportation, buildings, energy and waste management which have contributed significantly to generating greenhouse gas emissions. The 19 pandemic is an opportunity for the world's cities to put climate action on top of their agenda. This is a chance to change how we generate our power, construct our buildings, heat, cool, and light up our offices and homes, and travel around from home to work. Depends on national, regional, and local governments with organizations, communities, institutions, the private sector, and everybody working together to create sustainable, carbon neutral, inclusive cities and towns. Accelerating a proper urban action on a housing program is very key to ensuring a carbon free world for the survival of our planet and humanity in general. Stakeholders appeal to governments throughout Nigeria to become alive to their responsibility for planning as the environment can no longer cope with the constant abuse due to human activities. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.